Hey my friend Jean-Serge Gagnon here so today we're going to talk about the five reasons the top reasons why you would want to use Click eCourse to host your course so we're going to talk about things that you might already know about or things that you might not know about we're going to talk about why you should be using Click eCourse instead of other sites and we're going to talk about that in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets obviously there's lots of reasons to host courses online and platform A or B or C or D why would you want to host it on Clicky Course? Clicky Course, if you don't know, is a platform I put together that I actually created. I'm a developer, I'm a programmer, so this is the kind of stuff that I do. But one of the things is I did it because I needed a platform to host my courses. And when I looked online at all the different platforms, I found all sorts of reasons that I, all sorts of little things, you know, little things I didn't like that much. So I decided to create a platform myself. So today I want to talk to you about why you should be hosting your course on Click eCourse instead of other sites. And we're going to get into that in just a second. And before I want to get into that, I want to let you know if you're listening to the audio you're probably going to want to go check out the video at a cis333.jsgagnon.com to go check out the video and the blog post because I'm going to do screenshots I'm going to share my screen that kind of stuff and you're going to be able to see a lot more than just hearing what I'm talking about right all right so first of all let me just share my screen I'm just going to right away tell you what uh, the top five reasons are right now in to use your uh, Click eCourse as a course hosting site as you can see right here I just kind of listed these basically the first reason is it's free to set up an account for you or your students you don't have to worry about having them to pay to even go look at your course and they maybe you want to sell your course and you're going to sell your course but they don't have to pay to go look at it they can go and look at the course without them having to pay that's obviously that's up to you you can make the site uh, we're going to show you how that works and what how you can do that you can choose to not do that but that is an option that you can do and I would recommend that the number two reason is that it's easier to create a video course one of the things I found on all the course platforms out there is that you have to create these modules and you have to set up these modules and decide what contents go in the modules and the, it's like there's so many little steps before you can just create a course so I made it so that you can just create a course by just uploading video of course you can make it super complicated that all the other sites you can have modules you can have all sorts of different things like that but the basics is much simpler at least I've found number three is you can offer a commission to your course to help sell it so you can actually have a commission and I probably should have said that you can also have coupons let's just say you can offer commission and coupons let's put coupons in there so you can also offer coupons and deals coupons and deals uh commission let's put yeah, yeah let's see Co coupons and deals and deals uh to uh your course to help sell it right so you can do that and that's relatively simple and the cool thing about offering commission is that you'll have other people promoting your course for you you can give them as much as 90 percent even 100 percent commission if you want it really depends on why you're uh having them sell it and the, the reason why you would want to give 100 percent commission is if you're looking for people to join your world right get on your list and that kind of stuff then you can offer the commission because you're not looking necessarily for sales you're looking for future sales so you would want people to just join your list maybe become students learn how, how about you that kind of stuff so that's one of the things you can do All right so that's number three number four it's more than a course hosting platform there's a feed on there there's groups there's blogging there's more than that and I'm going to show you how all some of those things and I'm going to kind of go through them and let you know how to use them how you can benefit from them and uh, yeah so it's it's a lot more than just a course hosting site um then number five is you can actually earn residual income by referring others to the platform that's one of the cool things 
there there's a free account on the platform and there's paid accounts and uh, the free account for example lets you have two courses on there if you want three courses or more you gotta pay for the for the uh, upgrade account and if you want you know 20 courses then then but anyways the different levels have different and the point of that is that if you are really a course creator you're going to want to actually get to the more advanced uh, um, uh, accounts and the cool thing is that if you refer others and they end up paying then you get a commission for that so you can actually build some resi nice residual income from that we're going to show you how to do that as well all right so first let's take a look at the actual site when you go to Click eCourse uh well actually let's go into let's log out I'm gonna log out let me just show you what it looks like when you first uh, go to the site and if I just reload the page here okay so when you're lo when you first go to the site you're going to see that it's basically a, a there's an about page it kind of shows you what the site's about and uh you can kind of uh, you know obviously read through that so we pay 75 percent commission you can have private label library you'd like to host somewhere maybe you have created videos to promote other products uh maybe um so it kind of goes through these different things there are different reasons why you might want to use clicky course now at first you might think well clicky course just like any other site I can host on all these different sites there's a ton of different sites where you're going to host courses and you're right you can you can host it you can even create just an email where you send links to your YouTube videos right and uh those are that 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 could be fine but there's lots of limitations to that right you can't organize the way it looks it's it's only YouTube that decides it your email is just an email you can't have people um recognize uh, whether they've watched one video or the second video which lesson they're on those kinds of things there's all these things that a course hosting site gives you as a benefit right you can actually keep track well your students can keep track of what they've seen and what they haven't seen right so when like uh, as I say when I say number one it's free to set up an account for you or your students what I mean by that is if you go to the site you click on the register right here you can actually continue as uh with Facebook here it'll automatically create the account for you set you up for free right it doesn't cost anything to do that once you have your account um you can actually create two courses up to two courses for free and host courses on the site now if we go to uh whoops let's just close this if we go here close okay so if we go to plans right up here you can see the different plans um and the pricing and all that but also what I wanted to kind of uh, show you is you can um anonymous let's see current plan free plan um I'm actually not logged in I'm actually in here this is kind of where I'm at but as a free account you can create public pages and post to them you can create public private and secret groups uh you can access uh, there's weekly training open um, create open access self-directed courses you can save progress of courses you can embed videos from Facebook and Vimeo as lessons you can send private messages to other members you can comment on courses lessons or news feed and rate courses you can earn income by referring others to buy courses you can earn income by selling your own courses as well right so the free account allows you all that plus more right create your own blog you can hide profile from public view you can create upload and give away your own courses uh, a syndication engine upload video and generate sharing artifacts so these things are all available even on the free plan as you can see right here yes 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 in green that's all of this is available in the free plan now if you go upgrade then there's other things you can do in the more expensive plan but also here is another thing that you're going to be might be interested in is if you sell other people's courses you're going to get a commission from their sales so if they if they if they sell the course for a thousand dollars and they give you 50 percent commission you can get five hundred dollars right you can get up to five hundred dollars depending on which uh, plan you're paying so if you're on the ten dollar a month plan you get 25 percent of that 500 dollars the rest of it goes upstream I guess in the in the referral tree uh your commission from your shared referral memberships is the same here you get a certain percentage of the membership payment somebody's paying a hundred dollars a month 75 30 or 150 you get a percentage of that so that's uh we're talking about the free account still sorry I'm not uh I should have probably 
gotten into that afterwards but yeah so the in the free account so the free account is really simple like I said you just click on the register here and I'm going to create a new, a new account with the episode that we're doing right now which is 333 let's just do that and I'm going to click on register so the free account lets you uh, create an account just like that you just that's all you do and then you go to your emails let's refresh the emails you'll get an email that says that you got a new account and then you have a link to activate it now if you were to use your Facebook it wouldn't do that you would automatically just right away get access to the site right and so if I go uh, back now I'm on the on the feed here right um and if I go to now I've got my account right so I've got my account created I can I have all these features I can access right here uh which weren't there when I when I was on when I was not logged in if I go to this page no this page so over here I was not logged in right so that's why there was register and log in once you're logged in you have a profile picture that you can actually edit I can go to my profile picture in basic info I can set up my own profile picture right there um set up my display name my first name my anyways all those things you set all that for free right the free account lets you do all those things and you can even create a course uh are we where which so we're still in the free account for your students as a student you could have a course like for example right now I I might be talking to people about a course let's just look at the courses here I have a course that I'm selling for I don't know let's say I've got this octo content course right here that I'm promoting that's you know five thousand dollars or whatever and I'm trying to get people to to buy it right I can actually send them the link to this course if I look at this let's open this in and if I'm not even logged in not even logged in I'm going to see this right I can send this link to people right and they'll access this they'll see what this course is they can actually see the different lessons right none of them they can't watch anything because it's it's not a free course right uh, but you can have them create an account and access the course but you know they can see it even with the free account or even without an account but you can make the course so that they can't access it unless they actually create an account that's a different way of doing it the other option is you can actually set the course up so that they need to buy it before they can even access it I wouldn't recommend that unless you're <laughs> you know uh, promoting it and it's a private course and you want to make sure people that is nobody can find it and that you know all that's possible on the site so uh there's those different levels you can have you can have a public a free course that you give away to the public like I have for example if I look at the courses <coughs> for me I have for example my simple online strategies no, no which one should I show you uh the top 10 simple online strategies right here this one here is actually a free course right see how it says free right here and you can actually watch these it says watch free lesson right so you can actually watch these even if you're if you, even if you're not um if you um if you did not buy it or add it to your library you can still watch it even if you're not logged in I believe let's go in incognito and show you how that looks if I go to that link right oh and by the way to create your account you want to go to course in uh, click ecourse which is this link here so you're going to want to go there click ecourse.com just go set up your account and create a course if you'd like so as you can see right here it says all oh, watch free public lesson right then it says log in to add I'm not logged in so this is one example of a course where it's a free course that you're giving access to to it to anybody they don't even need an account to actually view the videos and access it the thing about that is that if they don't have an account then they won't be able to come back tomorrow and, and know that they've seen the first two or the first three or whatever it is right they won't know that because it won't it can't keep track of it if you you need an account to be able to keep track so that's why somebody would want to uh check that out right to be able to access your um your course right so you want your course you want them to create an account because it'll give them the ability to go through each of these uh and know where they were they can go they can go on a, on their phone and then on their desktop and then on their laptop all these different devices and they can keep track of where they are they can actually watch 
one of the lessons on their phone and then come back to their computer later and the system will know where they were right it keeps track of that like that and that's probably not much different than other course hosting sites but that's one thing that's important to note why they would need an account right so that's that's creation of a free account you can do that on Click eCourse now number two what's number two number two it's easier to create a video course now what do I mean by that so if I go to the site uh, where am I right here no no here okay if I go to the site I'm not I'm I'm logged in here right and I go to the to the to my home or to the feed right I see the feed here I can actually click on the plus right there and click create a course so when I create the course all I got to do is give it the uh, test course test course so I give it a description test for cis333 episode right and then I can give it some details you will learn all about x right and I can uh, this is a this is a hello world uh, html right so I can actually take this I can make this a little bit bigger I want this to be whoops so whoops I still I gotta select it size number five right there I can make this bold if I want right I'm going to add images all those kinds of things anyways I click on next I can actually go through these as well I just go um, right now I'm just creating a course this is there's lots of things you can do but I won't go through that but over here you might want to say it's an unlisted course only buyers can access it only logged in people that's where I was talking about anyways I don't want to complicate things but just do a I just do an unlisted right here and I'm going to say done all right so now I've got this course there's I should obviously have a thumbnail for it but right now it says you'll learn about x it's test for three cis hello world right and then all I got to do is add lessons I just click on the plus here and I just specify a YouTube link so let's go to my YouTube channel and let's just uh, take uh, one of these this one here comment grabber stuff well, let's just take this video get the shareable link go back to click eCourse I'm going to post the link there I'm going to save it that's it so now I've got one video in my course and it's saving it and there you go I can add another one I'm going to put this next one which is I don't know let's get this one let's share the link so now I'm putting two videos in my course I can put up to I think it's 10 on the free account let's actually show you what I'm talking about there's limits obviously for the free account but still under the plans you can see that under the free account you can have two courses and you can have 20 lessons so that means you can have one course with 20 lessons or two courses with 10 lessons each or one course with like five the other one with 15 right that's kind of what that means so uh in the now I can go back to my courses right here and I can see the course that I created right here the hello world course so I can go back to it I can see that now I have the two lessons in it I'm going to make these two lessons public now this course is unlisted that means that if I was to go to the the, the main site here and I was to search for it it wouldn't be in the list of courses that are there right it does it just won't show up here but I can actually go and share this link to this course this link that's up here I can actually share that link to the um to somebody else so and then when they go to that link they get they can access and see what the course is about right they're going to see the the lessons here it says login to add right because it's even though it's free they can access it and they can see it now the uh, you can make this course a, a non-free course if you want uh, if I edit the course I can make it a course that's uh that's uh, the price commission right here I can make it you know 250 dollars and I can give 50 percent commission to people who refer my course commission to only people that are paid site members the or free users let's give it to free users say done and then when I look at it, it says 250 if I go back to here instead of free now it says it's 250 dollars right 
$250 now what is the next thing we're talking about okay offer commission was so number three is you can offer commission that's what I just did there I showed you how to offer commission but coupons and deals and you can also do that so for example say you have you're offering this as a bonus to uh, or or maybe you're selling this at the end of a webinar or something right well you know how in a webinar you typically give the price of something to uh over um <clears throat> oops what's going on here yeah so to over um 10 times the price you're actually selling so you could make this if I go back here let's go edit here I'm going to edit this again and this is a course that I'm actually going to be selling for well I'm going to be selling for 250 but I want people to see that it's worth 2500 dollars so I'm going to put 2500 right here now the course shows up as 2500 but I can give a coupon and I can say uh, web web deal one or whatever it's going to be 250 and I just say this I add that to the to the course and now I can send this link copy link address now if I reload this it just still says 2500 right if I go to here and I reload it now it says 2500 so this is like oh my god this is worth 2500 okay what if I give you this coupon I'm going to give you this coupon or the link directly with the coupon in it now you can actually get it for 250 because this is a super deal I'm giving you right now at the end of this webinar you can actually go to the site you can actually see the course and you know whatever you're telling them that right telling them that in your webinar you can actually go to the site here look the, the site the course is 2500 but today only and there could be a um a limit to the time that the coupon works or you can actually have uh you can actually have um whoops that's not what I wanted you can actually have cancel and go back here uh, manage deals and coupons you can actually have a maximum number of I don't think the edit works yeah I gotta fix that but you can actually create a coupon that has a maximum of let's say 10 you don't want more than 10 people to get it at that price or 50 people to get it at that price or whatever you decide and then when they see that if I put coupon let's say web deal web deal 2 I'm going to make it 250 as well but there's going to be a maximum of 10 so I save that now if I use web deal 2 instead of web deal 1 if I go back here web deal 2 right it's going to be the same price but it's going to have a maximum it'll say 10 of 10 right because right now nobody's bought it yet but if people buy it that number will go down so you your your attendees to your webinar are going to be able to see oh my god there's only eight left or there's only five left or two left or whatever right because after that the price goes back to twenty five hundred dollars right okay so that's that's the number uh, three you can offer commission coupons and deals to help sell it so uh where are we okay so number four it's more than a course hosting platform with feed groups blogging and more so where what are these so the feed for example is when you go to here you can see that the whenever you log into the site you automatically get on this feed page right which is basically well right now it's mostly course new lessons added to courses that I create content every day but you're also going to see people setting their profile pictures or posting to the news feed themselves uh right here it's like I said it's all new lessons two courses Let's see if I scroll down far enough um but it's a social feed right it's a social feed people can comment on it people can add uh, their own see this one here was a new course rated course rated a course right you can rate courses um and that's one of the things when I look at the courses if I look at the courses I can see them by rating right so the ratings are over here so this is five star five star five star this is four star this is four four right and I can actually uh show details which uh the number of lessons how long they are that kind of stuff and I can actually go into a listing view like this with all the details it shows me the rating right here 5.0 4.8 right 4.5 there's no rating on this one oh that's based 
but that's and then who created it right who is the creator it's all me right right now um and what else I can show the price or hide the price well the price is always going to show on the detail list but if I go to this I can just I can see just the images with no no price or anything right uh if I go to this one I can see the so this is just a dis different display right <clears throat> and I can also show also search for like I don't know Facebook search for just Facebook or search for LinkedIn <coughs> right <coughs> um and show all the courses so that's and then when I go to the feed I can see who rated courses and I can see so what else what else is there here I'm saying there's also a groups okay so under groups under more actually you're not going to see it because of this person's not logged in close this up if I go under more I don't have it so I'm going to go into my account because this account doesn't have it okay and let's log in continue as me there we go and if I go here actually it's under more there is groups so under groups it's kind of like Facebook you can create groups and in the groups you will be able to post to them uh, post content right and you're going to be able to see uh, units you're going to be able to see members um, and the about of the group right what the group is what else and that's that's still under development it's actually still a beta feature but it'll be a feature where you're going to be able to create groups you're going to be able to see those posts just like Facebook you're going to be able to see posts in um in the feed as well and there's also under discussion here is actually the feed of the group so just posts that are in the group they don't necessarily go to the, the main feed but sometimes they will right um so what else uh under what else did I say uh blogging all right so this is the other thing as an account you can actually have your blog right here you can actually set up your blog right in the platform when you set the blog in the platform um when you set the blog in the platform you have um <clears throat> well you basically have the ability to create your own blog like me I have my blog right this blog here of course uh, jeansergegagnon.com that's actually my blog it's actually hosted right in Click eCourse it's a WordPress blog that you can post whatever you want in it right and that's what that is so under under <coughs> yeah under here is Click eCourse now you can see I have my own blog right here it says it's jeansergegagnon.com you can set that up the way you want you can set up even the free account can you can have your own blog but it won't be a domain right it'll be uh, blog.clickequals.com slash whatever your name is right so that's uh, the other thing what else did I say uh, and more so and more there's lots of other things like syndication for example where you can actually create content um, for hosting on different platforms like me for example if I do that over here I've got all this content I can use I, I create one video I, I create a video upload it to YouTube then I use this to generate a two minute uh, video a five minute video a wave file for for a, a podcast some thumbnails uh some text the IGTV video that contains the burnt in subtitles in vertical format I mean all these things are created for me in the engine that's so that's there's lots of other stuff on clicky course other than just course hosting and finally you can earn residual income by referring others to the platform <coughs> so once you're uh once you have an account you can become a an affiliate right so under here you see affiliates right now it says I'm already an affiliate but it gives you examples here it says right here congratulations on being an affiliate now you can earn these commissions it gives you examples of what you can earn uh, for example if you're on the extreme plan you'll make 112 dollars if somebody uh pay buys the extreme plan right the extreme plan is 150 bucks a month why would somebody do that well they they might have a ton of courses they want to host or maybe they just want to get more commission uh and it's worth it because after you refer two people your your own commission is paid off right even one person and a half because it's 75 percent commission right so 
uh, that's those are the reasons why you would want to use click ecourse instead of other platforms like I said if we if you want to create an account you go to clickecourse.com the link I've got right on there and that's why you would want to use click ecourse as the site to host your course all right um there's and how do you become an affiliate there if you go here let's actually go to the other account let's log out and then go back to the other account actually if I let's go to the uh, incognito one if I go here and I click on affiliates under the when I'm not even logged in it'll kind of tell me to become an affiliate simple as entering some information uh, and accepting the rules and conduct before you can bring, you need to register for your account commission yours and based on, based on your plan maximum if you're if you're not getting 100 commissions the remaining commissions are rolled over to the person who referred you based on their plan so there's a there's a whole rolling commission thing <clears throat> but to become an affiliate it's really this simple if I log in here using this 333 account I created now if I reload this page it says right here that to become an affiliate it's as simple as entering some information that says click to become an affiliate so you just click on this it takes you to the page where you have to fill in stuff it's really just you know your last name your first name paypal make your account public your username bio display name anyways your address thing things like that right so just basically because it, we're going to be giving you money we have we have to go through the know your customer the kyc right uh, process so that's why you have to fill this in but once you fill that in you become an affiliate and then you have the links let's log in again then you have the links to share anything so if I log in as me <coughs> and I go back to the courses you can see any courses let's say for example octo content model that's five thousand dollars right so this one I can share this if I click on your link right here it gives me the link here's your link to share website and get 75 percent of commissions on your referring to monthly payments and then here's the link to the course itself um you can share that or the course right if I share this open that in here then what happens is somebody gets this and they decide to buy it or even they decide to register an account it shows that it's referred by me right so if I was somebody else if I was uh, um it would show the name of whoever referred them so that it allows you to make sure that they're using your link to get so that you get the commission right so that's how the um, partner referral works and yeah there's lots of other things but those are the five reasons why you should be using Click eCourse to host your course so if you have any questions obviously go ahead and comment below but until uh, next time and hope you enjoyed this and we'll see you in the next episode this has been Course Income Secrets, the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon, until next time.